and Kenya and South Africa have agreed on a raft of agreements that will bolster trade and investment between the two nations. Speaking at a high-level business summit in Nairobi, President William Bruto and his South African counterpart Cyril Ramaphosa stated that their governments will address hurdles experienced by businesses, including identifying, monitoring, and resolving non-tariff barriers that limit the trade potential between both countries to strengthen trade and investment. Our very own Faisal Ahmed was at the high-level summit and has this report. President William Ruto and his South African counterpart Cyril Ramaphosa witnessed the signing of three memorandums of understanding and cooperation agreements to augment bilateral relations between Nairobi and Pretoria. The deals will see Kenya and South Africa cooperate in the fields of housing, among others, and increase trade between the two nations by reducing the bureaucratic red tape experienced by businesses in both countries. Kenya and South Africa are struggling to export to Europe and all manner of places. And yet there exists market and opportunity in Kenya and South Africa. Something must be wrong with us, honestly. We cannot continue this. Europe, you've heard, is trading at 70 percent. 70% of trade, intra-European trade. President Ramaphosa on his part stated that the ties existing between the two nations will be made stronger by ensuring a streamlined trade and investment network between the two nations. There is a great deal of trust that we can rely on. The other thing that holds us back is bureaucracy and a regulatory environment, which President has already spoken to. And we already identified a number of things that we can do to unlock the way we deal with each other. South African Trade and Investment Minister Ibrahim Patel said that more needs to be done in ensuring industrialization is realized between the two nations. We have this opportunity to hear from the two excellencies on their vision. And as uh, members of the respective cabinets, we've already uh, been put to task to step up the work that we do in order to address all the challenges that have come out in the business forum, in the bilateral trade talks. And we have agreed with Minister Patel to set up a joint committee to unlock the non-tariff barriers which are hindering trade between our two nations. We had very strict instructions from our two presidents to do everything possible to look at the issues of logistics, to the issues of delays in our borders, and Kenya is actually taking the first step by establishing the first two uh, bordered custom warehouses, one in Johannesburg and one in Pretoria. The heads of state pledge to accelerate trade between the two nations and ensure that they benefit from the Africa Free Continental Trade Agreement to accelerate investments and boost inter-Africa trade. The visa-free travel for Kenyans to South Africa, together with the other pronouncements made by the heads of state and the business community, is expected to bolster trade between the two nations. Faisal Ahmed, Citizen TV at the KICC, Nairobi.